Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Um, so glad you joined me today. Um, so today we're going to continue with the uh, journal Christmas journaling series. Um, and it's a lot of decorating at this point because what I might write or put in the journal are probably going to be personal things. So we, I just like to set the stage on the page for what I might do for the journaling part of it. I also wanted to say that I'm going to be doing, calling them episodes rather than day one, day two, day three. And that's more just to take the pressure off me, <laughs> not to do, I feel I need to do something each day. So this is going to be episode three. And this is what we did last time. We made the uh, little, well, we had made that before. We just placed it in. We have this little side tuck, this double tuck. that has that little window up there. So we can journal back here. And um, I made this very quickly at the end with a piece of coffee stain paper and some pretty toque paper. And that's another great place to journal. And then we have this flip. Here we added this little um, tuck spot. We can journal on the back of this. We can put something else in there to journal. And we've got these two little bits in there. And this these this element and this was already made and we just zhuzh that one up a little bit. Okay, so let's look at what would we do for our second day. Uh, and I don't know, or our second entry, I don't know that I would go, um, you know, page by page. Like in episode three, we might decorate this page. We might come back here on episode six. You just never know. I'm kind of feeling the, um, I love this vintage paper. So, and I, you know how much I love that image. So let me see, what do we want to do on this page? Maybe. I'm just going to take some wash and set it there so that'll stay open. Let me see. Well, you know what? We could use, let's see, do we have, whoops. We have our bits that we already have made. And I know I want to use this somewhere. Ooh, but I also love this. Okay, let's take these two out and see if there's, if we want to put something here. So, that is super cute. Isn't that cute? I love that. And that was from, um, oh gosh, for some reason my mind just went blank. blank. I'll think of it. Anyway, it'll, I'll, I'll link it below. But it was something that came with an order that I made from a, a lovely Etsy shop here in Canada. Uh, and then we have this bit, and it folds out like that, and then like this. Actually, this might be a good one to set in here, I think, because I like this being on that side. Uh, and the colors look so great together. So if I attach it on three sides, then I can put a tag or something behind it. So I think that's what I'm going to try and do. We can make the tag together in the time that we have. I hope we have time to do that. If you hear any munching sounds, that's Midge. She's got her little toy on the carpet here. She stopped and looked up at me when I said her name. Um, so yeah, and this was something we made together. So you can check the playlist um, for Christmas or December Daily. Uh, I think it's in both of those playlists. The Christmas playlist has everything, I think, from December Daily, but it also has any Christmas journals that I've uh, shown you as well that I've made and completed. Okay, so I'm using Art Glitter Glue. And I'm not quite taking it right to the edge. I'm just coming close, like so. How's everybody doing? I forgot to ask you that. I hope you're all well. So this has got lots of space in it. Um, it's so cute. Aren't they cute? I was really pleased with how they turned out. Okay, so that is in there. Meanwhile, I want to make a um, tag to go in. Let me see. Just going to grab my 
grab my cutter and I'm going to try three and a half and see if that's a good amount of size. Let's see. Careful not to Okay, so that's going to be fine. It's not going to encroach too much and there's no damp glue, so I think I'm good. Okay, so we want to do, while that's drying, I'm going to uh, make a tag with this to insert down. So I'm just going to bring you in a little tiny bit so you can see a little bit better. And so I'm not distracted by what's behind, uh, like all of the little bits on the edge there, let's see. Um, I think my, oh, my quotes would fit on there. So we could stick a quote on there uh, if we want it. So I'll pull those out and we'll think about that after. Um, I think I want to use some nice paper. So we'll go with green this time, I think. I'll take this. These, I'm just taking those out of my, um, my folio, my organizer. Okay, let's see will this fit. Yep. So I'm just going to take and fill the background with the green for now. And then we'll see what we want for an image and whatnot. The nice thing about using, I like using craft cards. I also have another one that I picked up recently. It's more of a parchment color. It's not called parchment. Um, but I, uh, and it was a recollections color as well of uh, cardstock. So we've got that on there, like so. Just gonna cut down the side here. If you guys, how you're doing? I hope you're well. It's just been one of those mornings. Midge, I had Midge out for her walk this morning, and I have to tell you, it was ridiculously cold uh, this morning. So it was, uh, I enjoyed the very, very hot shower <laughs> when I came in, I have to say. So I'm going to take that paper. Put it back in my folio here at the back. And let's have a look and see if there's anything that stands out to us in terms of an image or um, something that we'd like to have on the tag. So, this cute little fella with the tree. I think that looks really nice. That might be really good. And I was already thinking about putting the, um, having the, um, I'll just move that out of the way, one of these in the background. Where did I put my ruler? There's a good question. I swear, I'm, I'm, I'm getting more and more forgetful. It is, it's not a word of a lie, I really am. Okay, Christmas is doing a little something extra for someone. That's Charles Schultz. Oh, that's lovely. Every time we love, every time we give, it's Christmas. That's Dale Evans. Um, Dale Evans from Roy Rogers. Let's see. That's nice. Christmas isn't just a day, it's a frame of mind. I think I saw that somewhere. I saw, I've got that twice. Two different fonts. That's nice. Blessed is the season which engages the whole world in a conspiracy of love. I like that one. I'm going to use that because I cannot find my ruler. I don't know where I would have put it, but there you go. I'm just going to set that here. 
try and keep this straight as I can, like that. And I think the other side, my thought is, I will tear the other side so that it's behind this little fellow, little gal or guy. I don't want it a little bit wonky. I don't want it to be like real straight. Save that because you can use that for something else. And my thought is if we put this over here, like maybe line it up with the edge, you can have that sweet, sweet little uh, person there. And I think it would be nice. I'm going to use some of this washi. See, I'm using more and more washi. Um, first, let's glue this bit down, and then I'll go from there. So, yeah, so um, I'm, you guys have said so many lovely things about my Christmas videos. I really appreciate it. Appreciate you following along, and um, I really appreciate you subscribing. I don't think I've ever said that before, but I really would. <laughs> I um, appreciate all of you who have been a part of this channel for a while and those of you who are just beginning. So I think that's absolutely fantastic. Okay, so I'm just tearing a bit off because I don't like it to be too square coming in from the side. This is just to get give some depth of color. So I'm just going to Put some glue on there. I'm trying to think if I have any fun grandchildren stories as of late. Oh, <laughs> okay, I will tell you this one. It is kind of hysterical. Um, our uh, we do a a swap, a Christmas swap with um, our adult kids, uh, not with grandkids, because you know they're they're. Uh, that's a special kind of gift that you want to give them. Um, anyway, so I just thought it would be nice to bring that in a little more. So um, my husband uh, had a had a bad fall about actually two weeks ago, and um, quite a landed face planted, as he would say, and uh, he didn't need stitches, but he he really did. Um, hit his face quite badly and it was just one of those things where you you trip over something uh, that you didn't expect to be there kind of deal anyway when our granddaughter Alice saw him <laughs> she said oh Popsy you know are you okay like they were very concerned and he he said look I'm fine have a look and so they looked and they said oh, okay and uh, she said you know Popsy if I had your name for Secret Santa I would give you bandages. <laughs> and it was said in such a dear way. She was basically wanting to give him all the support she could. But, oh my gosh, he just could not stop laughing. When he told me that story, he was over there doing some painting for them. And uh, when he told me that story, I just, I said, yeah, that is, that's our darling Alice. <laughs> and she didn't know she was being funny. It was so cute. What if we make our tab out of fabric and just put it there, I think. It would be kind of nice. So I'm just putting some glue there. And uh, oh, art glitter glue works well with fabric. It has in my experience anyway. And then I'm just going to put some there and fold it over, making sure I still have a bit of a tab. And I like those little bits that are hanging. I think that looks really cute. So, just making sure I have glue at the top. And, yep, the bottom is glued. So that's our little, our cute little tag to go with um, our little insert that we put in here. And we can See once again that it that it opens and she will fit. Yep. 
So that's going to set out the side. Actually, I love that. I love that little tab there on top of that. I love all the plaids. I have to say they look so nice. Okay. Um, you could put a bit of washi here if you want it too. I think we've got lots. Uh, we've got that tag. We've got those. We could put something on this tag. That might be fun. Okay, let's see what we have. Let me move my quotes out of the way. And um, let's see. I have up in here, sorry, I have this doily. And that, no, it doesn't quite cover, it doesn't quite cover it. And I kind of, I think I want the tag covered and not see the brown, so I'm going to move that out of the way. I'm going to put it back in. Now this is probably way too close for you now. Let me just go back a bit. There we go. Um, oh, I know. Why don't we look at, why don't we look at one of these um, pieces of ephemera that we have. Uh, from Rachel. Now let's just have a peek and see if we put her there. We won't get all of her legs, but that's okay. Would that be hitting her? I feel like it will be okay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go for it. I'm just gonna glue all over this oval. And this was a dollar store tag find. And then hopefully, I can see from behind, I can, that she's right there. And we can get that one. There goes Midge. She's bored with me not talking to her. Yeah, we had, like I said, a lovely walk, but it was bitter. Uh, and I hadn't thought about wearing a scarf, which I've just, when I came back, I put the scarf on the hanger so that uh, with my coat so that I won't forget next time because it's the kind of cold that when the wind hit your face it almost took your breath away so uh, yeah that was not super pleasant but it was okay I mean you have to expect that stuff for oh my gosh she's so cute so cute just set her there. I think that looks really, really sweet. Do I want to put that hole there? Will that put... I don't think I need to put the hole there, if I'm honest. Um, but if I did, then I could put a little bit of ribbon. What have I got here? If I got a piece, I do. A piece of sari. All right, let's... The fact that I could see the sari there, maybe that'll be my determinant on the fact that I'm going to actually punch that hole. And I'm going to, there we go. Oh, it's not too bad, it's just in her hat. Um, Midgey, she thinks she hears something. We've already vacuumed today and I have to say she detests the vacuum. Like she even growls when she sees it somewhere. Like, um, but she will bark the whole time I'm vacuuming and it is not a pleasant experience but what can I say she's made it known that she's not a fan so um, she doesn't have very many bad habits I'd say but certainly barking when I, the with on the vacuum or about the vacuum is one um, another one is barking when she hears a dog in the neighborhood so I mean, that's part of her job, I think, as a, uh, as a Shetland Sheepdog, is to, uh, you know, warn us <laughs> when there are these terrible predators around. Uh, so I think I'll put a little bit of color down here. Uh, and I've got, I've got this lovely gold stripe, and I've got a green and a red. Now, is that... Yeah, I can set that there, and I think that looks nice. 
So I'm going to glue that down. And the nice thing about this little pouch is that I've got these Tim Holtz uh, cards in there right now, but I'll probably end up putting uh, some printed photos in there, uh, in each one. And it's just a nice way to um, display a photo, for sure. Let's see, what else do I have that I might want to use? I've got this piece that we didn't use from... Um, I like this bit here at the bottom. Well, I mean, I like it all, but I mean, for this purpose, I like this bit. And that could go here. And just, just kind of tear that away. So this is the way I, I do these sort of decorating things. Anyway, don't, pardon me, I know there'll be some of you who'll say, I hope you're husband is okay. He really is. Um, I wasn't, I was really worried about it at first, but we made sure we did all the proper checks to make sure he didn't have a concussion and whatnot. So we are good. Now I have the other part of this green washi, sorry, and it occurs to me that I might as well use it. And I think using it under this word present would be nice. There. Okay. And maybe we have something else we want to put. Maybe that's fully decorated. So something else we might want to put on there. Let's see. Now I'm just going to take my three papers, package them up again, and put them in here, and move that. I think there might be one of those Tim Holtz words, like Mary, or what did I have? I had Mary and I had Believe, or Holiday. I'm going to use Holiday, I think. Here comes Midge. Hey, darling. So... I think it might be kind of fun to put holiday right here or here. That's up at the top, so I think I want this one down at the bottom. So I'm going to set it there. So this is was part of the, a Tim Holtz ephemera kit that I had. So we'll set that there. I like seeing a bit of that stripe all the way around it. So nice. So we've got a little tag. It's got these little bits. It's the nice thing about a cloth cover is that nothing really, you can't really get too fat with that. Um, I might do it this way. I might put her in here. I think she shows up better and this will close better. Put that in there like that. And then we did a, a nice card together that we can journal on. You could put another piece of paper to extend it on the back as well. Um, so yeah. So this is the way I typically do decorate or journal. You know what, I'm going to cut a tiny bit off the top because it's sticking a little. I mean it can go in and out but I don't want it to be uh, difficult. So I'm going to cut that off. So my question to myself is, did I make that straight or not? I don't think I did. There we go. Okay. And we're just going to put that in there. And that's much better. Perfect. Okay, guys, thanks again for watching episode three, and I will see you again next time. Take care, everyone. Bye.